I want you to tell everybody right now what you think of Ron Paul. Ron Paul, uh, he's got some good points with the track people, but he's got some bad points that attract some bad people also. And that's, that's causing a problem for uh, the, the Tea Party Patriot movement. Uh, because it, unfortunately it's opened the door to uh, some whack jobs. Like whom? Anybody in particular? Uh, well, the 9-11 the, the truthers are the most uh, visible. Um, Sure, there are other unsavory people, but they tend to keep to themselves. You know? But you know, we're, we're trying to uh, you know, police the movement and, and make sure that uh, that uh, those kinds of people uh, don't uh, you know, get into the leadership or anything like that. No, but how, how are you doing that? Because it seems like they seem to be overwhelming to begin with. No, they're not overwhelming to begin with, but they're visible. Okay. But, you know, if, if someone shows up as, as a truther to a tea party, people are reluctant to run them out, but so they, you know, they, they kind of get maneuvered to the back of the crowd. So let me give you an example, and this is the record directly to Ron Paul. When Stormfront gave, well, Don Black from Stormfront gave him uh, $500, and he, he didn't give it back. And he would not give it back, yeah. But what do that you think good. he should have done with the money? Do you think he should have kept he, it? He should have given it back. He should have, I know he understands, you know, the con he says, well, I'm not responsible for people's views. They want to give me money, that's fine. But for goodness sake, you got to have some standards, just like I went after Barack Obama for taking money from Jody Evans. After you know, He's going to have to explain Jody Evans. Jody Evans, uh, co-founder of Code Pink, she uh, supported Saddam Hussein, she supported the terrorists in Iraq, she works with Dr. Medinichad, she works with Hugo Chavez, Fidel Castro. She's bad news. If you believe in, in freedom and equality, you don't want to stand with Jody Evans. Okay, so and bottom. Yeah, and that's the same thing of Ron Paul holding on to uh, Stormfront money. <laughs> but actually, it was. And, but he also has a legislative director that hangs out with Joseph Sobrand. So, yeah. there's, there's also that. I mean, it, it, it gets a little nasty when it comes to Ron Paul. Well, you know, when movements this big happen, it, it suddenly becomes a big tent that everyone talks about, and you go, oh, please, just, just leave us alone. Just how big is this tent, man?